I was going to put this stuff. What is that? I wrote this yesterday. Guys, Ozo is always, always, always trying to show um, Nengi his love in any way that he actually can. So guys, today I'm going to be gisting you guys on what Ozo, Dorothy and Kidwire's manager and then Kidwire's dad had to say yesterday. So I just felt like, let me come give you guys an update. But before we get right into this video, if you're seeing me for the very first time, hi, my name is Vicky. And please, please, please consider to hit on that red subscribe button and, and subscribe to my YouTube channel and make sure to turn on your, your notification bell so that YouTube will inform you whenever I post a new video. And please, guys, go subscribe to my other channel. Please, please, please. There I post video on lifestyle, family, and vlogs. There you will see more of my personal life. Thank you so very much because I know you guys will rep yourself over there. Guys, yesterday, all the, it was time for the darling yankee tax to get and in the middle of the tax guys also had to call Nengi into the room giving her the note that he actually wrote for her and i'm like ah really nice all right something back then when i'm done getting some no we're going to win no eh? Bro. Eh? time for business leave me alone I can't see. 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 I can not see i can not a beautiful thing. You guys go get yourself some lovers and stop calling us a mumu. <laughs> because some people are called abusing us. Some people, you know, because of in this country, we are so used to interposing kind of love. So we just do not feel the need to to see how Ozo is acting or to feel how Ozo is acting. We feel that it's too it's too mumuish. If there is a word like that, you get. So that's just what actually happened. And then moving on, Ozo and Dorothy were having a conversation. Ozo displaying his insecurity still with Nengi. I don't understand what's wrong with Ozo. Nengi was playing Ludo yesterday with um, Prince and Ozo was having a conversation with um, Dorothy expressing that, as in like feeling like some sort of insecure. I cannot just put the whole clip here so that DSTV will not come for this video. But at the end of the day, Dorothy was asking Ozo that she and him and Nengi, they like going to take a bath. That what really happened, you get and Ozo was telling Dorothy that they have never been intimate before. They've never gone beyond him holding Nengi's hands. Somebody said something yesterday. Okay, Leko said something about um, not being intimate. And I was like, not in public. Mm. Like for you guys. I noticed that you guys don't like, like all them PDAs. Like them. Oh, oh, God. So for those of you who have been thinking that ah, Ozo and Nengi, they've been taking a bath together, that means they've been doing it in the bathroom. That's a lie. You've heard it from the horse's mouth. It is a lie. Remember that the bathroom is both male and female. And trust me, most of them do not pull off their clothes going completely naked to take a bath. So you guys should just get that thing that you're thinking off your head please, please 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 get it off your head right now because i know you guys like asher more than i do about you get you keep pretending and then moving on guys yesterday from nowhere we just saw that kid wires manager just came online and was having a live chat with someone else and was talking about how lacon how kid wire is still friends with lacon playing with lacon talking with lacon not knowing all what lacon has said about him another thing i need to drop inside guys the reason why Lekon and Kid, like Kid is cool. I need you to understand, he doesn't know anything Lekon has said, said, said about him. Please, I yeah. am begging you. So wait, what? so if, if Kid knew, he would never fuck with him? Right off, right off. Right, I will come into the screen myself, like what the hell? Do you understand what I'm saying? Literally, what he doesn't know, and I just he need doesn't to know. Like that. No one has uh -huh. told him. I beg. And now we don't hear that talk now. Make tell me. Maybe I do not know what has Lekon actually said about Kidwire. As in, 
what gossip what bad thing because i might not know i don't know it for all but at this point i think i cannot remember hearing lacon saying anything bad against kidwire so where is the talk coming from was that conversation necessary what is she trying to do i don't understand it, to me it wasn't necessary because i have not heard lacon i cannot remember so if you have remembered or if you know anything lacon, lacon has said um against kidwire in the past please Drop it in the comment section. I really want to know. Mm, yeah, me, I want to know. I don't want to be left in the dark. And then moving on, guys. Finally, Kid Wire's dad has spoken about the Erica's disqualification. He talked about how much he sees that Erica really loved Kid Wire. That if Kid Wire eventually wins, if let's concentrate on that word, if Kid Wire wins, that he the, he's going to make sure Kid Wire gives Erica the half of the prize money which is 42.5 million naira hmm. <laughs> and gives the remaining half to charity i don't know i cannot force anybody on my son it's, it's his own decision but to me as a uh, as a human being she is a wonderful 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 person she is just a very very just a very very good heart and uh, really if uh, if my son should win this i will uh, make sure that he gives her half of her uh, uh, half of his oh. winning. yeah oh. yeah he, yeah oh. he gives yeah he gives her half, oh. half of the winning and then the rest half to to charity you know to charity so really she has really really sacrificed her own uh, position to to support him so and uh, this is a time everybody should support her everybody should know what she's uh, uh, she's going through uh my uh um my son uh i think my son is in touch uh uh, uh with her in and i'm like that word if if i won't give the babe money make gonna give her money because at this point we are not sure kid why is ever going to win that show because icons are not joking at all icons they did not come to play so what do you guys think about that conversation kid why has that had with dele momodo you get because it's on i insta life that we got the information so to me i just felt like kid wire is definitely not going to win the show so if i want that her money whether not five million i won't give whether not ten million knowing how much the girl is desperately in love with kid wire or really needs kid wire i feel it will be better than saying if kid wire wins because you and i know that kid wire might really not win the show like he's saying you get so that's just basically it. What are your thoughts about the whole of this um, thing I've just told you guys about? The others love later to Nengi. Nengi has refused to reciprocate. In fact, when they were having exercise in the morning earlier yesterday, Nengi was all telling us all that we are not in a relationship. So all this your pattern of always trying to, to steal kisses should not happen. We, are, we cannot be doing what people who are in a relationship are doing. And I'm like, Nengi, the fact is, Nengi is always making it clear Stating it to Ozo that they are not in a relationship, but Ozo is crazily, stupidly head over heels in love with Nengi, and he's ignoring every of the thing that Nengi is saying because Nengi made it clear to him even in the morning, telling him he should stop trying to steal kisses because yes, you see Ozo always wanting to steal kisses from Nengi, and Nengi is always putting him straight. That girl is not ready to fall for that guy. Maybe not inside the house, maybe outside, yeah, but inside the house. I'm not sure he is ready to have anything to do with Ozo, go as far as Ozo is willing to go. And then the whole Kid Wire manager thing, what are your thoughts about it? And his dad, what are your thoughts? Please leave all in the comment section. I really would love to read your thoughts about it. I just felt like, ah, uh, I don't know if this video, the audio of this video will be so clear because it's raining heavily. I just hope you enjoyed this video. Please, if you do, give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment in the comment section. Your number one, I'm a bot that I put just body here on YouTube. You'll always come to your rescue when it comes to just like this. Thank you so very much for watching my video. Please, if you've not subscribed, hit on the red subscribe button and subscribe to the channel. And please, 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 go subscribe to my personal channel, supporting your girl. Thank you. And I will most definitely see you guys in my next video.